Hey everybody, Kent Larson here. I just uh, a lot of people out there trying to figure out uh, you know certain things they can do if they suffer from vector-borne illnesses. Uh, how to have a good uh, water supply with you while you're out there about uh, having your day. And uh, here's one thing that I do. I uh, I go down to the local uh, grocery store. They have a health market there, or you can get this in a lot of. Uh, uh, vitamin stores, etc. It's called Essentia. It's a pH water of 9.5, so it's a, it makes you more uh, alkaline, which is exactly what you want. It's also filtered, and it's really good for it. I actually know the gentleman that originally invented this uh, over 10 years ago. Um, uh, but uh, anyway, it's it's available. It's very affordable, and uh, they they also have these smaller sport size bottles. Now this right here is a lot better deal. But I use these because they got the pop tops on them, okay, and it makes uh, it very, very convenient for me to uh, make up a drink for me to carry with me. And as you can see, I got like two of them here. In the morning, I like to drink a full glass of this before I have breakfast or anything else like that. Uh, and maybe add uh, some uh, apple cider vinegar to it, okay, to get everything rolling. But uh, so let's talk about what you can put in these. What's what's really cool, and you want to do this. Uh, you want to fill them up with the dry ingredients first. And I'll take a couple bottles here, and I'll just show you what I do. Grab yourself a nice little funnel. Uh, have yourself a spoon available, and I always suggest having a steak knife because this will break the uh, the, the tension down inside of this uh, funnel. Should everything get packed up behind it. Uh, but a lot of us have gut issues, and the number one amino acid your body uses is L-glutamine. You can buy powdered L-glutamine on the internet, uh, GNC, local health food store, wherever. You know, make sure it's a good quality. But uh, this is terrific for your gut. It's also brain food, literally brain food. Uh, if you do take too much of it at night, it'll keep you up at night. Uh, if you take too much during the day, you'll have a better bowel movement. <laughs> so what I like to do is uh, take at least a teaspoon of this or two and put it through my funnel. As you can see, it just kind of drops down in there on its own. So that uh, right now I've got about, uh, what, uh, 10,000 milligrams of L-glutamine in there. So after that, what I like to do is I like to add what's called branched-chain amino acids. Branched-chain amino acids are the actual rebuilding amino acids for your muscles. A lot of us suffer from uh, muscle waste, etc. So we need to keep feeding these amino acids to our muscles. So uh, th this actually has a uh, a, uh, a little uh, spoon in it. I just throw a couple of those in there because what I'm doing here is I'm setting up a double dose of everything. It's really powdery. It's micronized. I mean, it's just like uh, powdered sugar. But I'll put that in there. And uh, I'll also, let me take my knife because this has gotten backed up up here. As you can see, as I do that, it'll fall down in there. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. All right, there we go. Also, because I want to break up the mucus that's inside of me from a uh, different candida uh, and uh, other things, is I will take two of these. This is called. This is a product called Yeast Away. Candex is another one that's similar to this. But I take Yeast Yeast Away, and I will put that in the water because it, it isn't uh, dependent on. Uh, it's an enzyme that breaks up. Uh, mucus and certain other things, candida, and so you don't have such a die-off effect. I'll put that in there. Once again, I want to get it down in the glass or the bottle. So I've got that in there, and this right here is what I would call my, uh, you know, my my uh, amino acid and my my uh, biofilm breaker. Okay, in a way, and I'll carry this and I'll rotate this with what the other uh, bottle I'm about to make. So we'll put that one over here. The other thing too is is a lot of people. Um, they want to make sure that they have something that uh, alkalizes their body correctly, okay? One thing is, is I see a lot of people going out, and uh, let me just explain this. They'll, what they'll do is they'll go out and they'll buy a bunch of lemons, all right? Now, most of you that have uh, vector-borne illness have budget constraints, and to be constantly buying fresh lemons to get the citric acid that's in there to break up the biofilm in your body, can be very expensive and taxing on our uh, our budget, and that means that we're not going to do it as often. So I opted out for this. That's right, that little 99 cent bottle of already squeezed lemon juice, because it is basically citric acid. Citric acid is a biofilm buster, and uh, I tell you what, I feel it every time I take this. Okay, so what I do with that is uh, I put that down in here, squeeze quite a bit of it. 
to do directly into the bottle. I kind of goof that up. Normally I go directly in the bottle. Get a bunch of it in there. All right. Now I am out of my powdered vitamin C. What I would usually do is add a gram or two of vitamin C in here with this because it really helps break up everything. Vitamin C is also really good for your, your gut. Uh, if you need to, you want to get buffered vitamin C. Okay. But uh, also, this little baby right here, yep, apple cider vinegar. There we go. We'll add some apple cider vinegar to that. I'll just go direct. Well, you know what? It's all going to be liquid in this anyway. So a little bit of apple cider vinegar in there. Remember, this is a like double quantity because I, I consider half this bottle to be a full serving. Now, um, another thing that you might want to do, okay, is add something like wheatgrass to another bottle. Wheatgrass would be really good with the original one that I did that's got all the branch chain amino acids in it and L-glutamine because it's such an alkalizer and it feeds the body so well. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to kind of backtrack. I'm going to add that right now. There we go. Now, if you don't have access to or you cannot afford, put two servings in here, or you not, cannot afford high pH water because you're so constrained on your budget, that's fine. Uh, I, you know, distilled water has had everything removed from it. You can buy it at a local grocery store or Walmart. Mart. It's usually 89 cents to 99 cents a gallon. Plus, you can use those empty containers, those gallon containers, for weightlifting and lunges at home. That's right, you need to exercise your muscles to keep your muscle mass up and drive antibiotics and everything else and oxygen to your body. So I've basically got everything I want in here. I just use my funnel, fill it up. There we go. Boop. A little bit too much. Well, that happens. You gotta pull the funnel up so you get proper uh, water and air movement here. I didn't do that, that's my fault. But uh, so there we go. I've got my two bottles made up. A little bit of room at the top so I can shake them. At this point, uh, I'm all done with it. I'll put the, put the caps back on. they got a clear cap that goes on here. I left those in the kitchen. Sorry about that. Um, this one here, I, I overfilled. Normally, I'd keep it right about here. And then I could sh that way, I could shake it up and get all this to work. The nice thing is, is also, I, I have a backpack that I carry all the time. These things go in these little containers on the side. And... Uh, Sometimes if you do this and it's not breaking up, you know, and it's all clumping like that, you can see here at the very top, what I'll do is to break it up, once again, remember, vitamin C, or what uh, citric acid does, it breaks things up. And that's how it helps you uh, inside, internally, is breaking up the, the mucoid plaque, etc. I'll put that in there, along with the powdered vitamin C or something, and that, that helps break it up. So. Anyway, this is Kent Larson. Just want to give you a few tips and hints of what I do. Hopefully this will help you on your day. God bless. Take care.